Welcome to Cut Above Tab of Aquarius. Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. Ooh, Aquarius, Aquarius. Aquarius. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, and other places. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment. Get in where you fit in, Aquarius. If you don't find nothing in this video, please check your other placement. I see you there too. If you're cruising and viewing, our views are appreciated. Return and subscribe. Thank you for your support. Now, Aquarius, this is a general message, okay? All right, the card at the bottom of the deck is the Ten of Swords. Ooh, wee. Ooh, wee. <laughs> All right. So, Aquarius, right now you might be finding things that are heavy. You also got the Ten of Swans. Good Lord Almighty. Now, I don't know what you're going through. All right, but we're going to find out together. All right. Okay, you also have the Five of Cups. Oh, Lord. All right, now, this is not all Aquarius, but this this is uh, a Aquarius. Okay, we got Aquarius is going through some changes. Okay. All right, we got that Ten of Swords over there. Now, the Ten of Swords is talking about feeling like somebody done you wrong, okay? All right, but I'm also using the Everyday Tarot deck. So, the, in this deck, it says you are experiencing a traumatic or a sudden ending that is tearing you apart. But on the positive side, this ending is creating a space of new opportunities to emerge. Wow. Okay. So, you got some new opportunities that are about to emerge, uh, Aquarius. You also have the Ten of Wands, and that talks about having some burdens as well. But I'm reading from the book, so let's see what it says. It says you're taking on extra burdens, workloads, and responsibilities. You know it is only temporary. So you are willing to put in the hard work now to accomplish your goals and reap the rewards later. Okay, okay. So, yeah, you felt like somebody did you real fucked up, you know, so to speak. All right. All right. You realize that this is just a temporary burden. Maybe you're taking on all the bills and challenges and stuff. Maybe you're doing it all by yourself. All right. For the for the time being. And as the time set, that uh, everything going to go back the way it was. You know, everything going to be peaches and cream, so to speak. Now, you got that five of cups over there. Now, the situation hasn't turned out the way you wanted it. All right so far all right and you expect that you will feel sad regretful or disappointed before you get completely lost into the dull drums look around you aquarius there are new opportunities and plenty when you are ready for them so when you get tired of going through whatever this is over here all right maybe you may yeah uh then they want you to realize that you got a that you got a whole bunch of other opportunities ahead of you. The next card is Empress card. So it was a yeah, it was an Empress. It could have been a baby mama. It could have been somebody's pregnant. Could have just been somebody's Empress. Okay, an older woman. Oh yeah, somebody. Yeah. Anyway, this person had you feeling some kind of way. Mm hmm. Yeah, you found it was kind of difficult for you to keep the stability, the harmony, the balance, and the peace. Yeah, that's what they did. Now, honey. Yeah, yeah, they put all the burden on you when it came to the household. Boy, that's fucked up. I'm sorry about that. But look like you saying, I think I better leave you alone. Pack my bags and get the hell on. See that? Because now, look what you had now. You're saying, you know what? Uh, uh, I think it's time to move around. Mm -hmm, you thought about it. So I'm going to go ahead on and read, if you don't mind. I write uh, Aquarius from this book. Try to get you raises up a little bit more because I want to try to keep the cards in the uh, in the camera. All right. So let's talk about your empress first. All right. Let's talk about this your empress. All right. So I'm assuming this is a male Aquarius. All right. Your empress says abundance and creativity flows to you. You embody the mother archetype and are bringing a new project into being. Your divine feminine energy flows through you as you grow and nurture your babies. Okay. So, Aquarius, are you saying that you feel like somebody backstabbed you, somebody got pregnant, and they told you that they couldn't get pregnant, but yet still now you find out somebody's pregnant? 
Okay. Ooh wee. Ooh wee wee. Okay. All right. And then you finding that uh, it's a burden on you trying to keep the household, the stability, and everything afloat. Okay. Is that what you're saying, Aquarius? Okay. Because you got that four of wands there, and that four of wands talk about balance and harmony as well as an unexpected guest <laughs> popping up. And, and a baby could be an unexpected guest. That's something that you wouldn't you were looking forward to. However, the four of wands also says you've been rapidly growing and expanding. Now it's time to pause and celebrate what you have achieved. Enjoy the fruits of your labor. And this could also mean that there could be a wedding on the horizon, a birthday, a homecoming, or just a family get-together. Could be also in the cards. All right? Yeah, so we already talked about that Five of Cups. You know, somebody being in their feelings and stuff, right? But you got the Six of Swords underneath that that talks about moving on, right? All right, so in this, book, in this deck it says you are in a state of transition. A physical move, a rite of passage, or a mental shift of some kind. You are leaving behind what was familiar and comfortable to move towards the unknown. And guess what, Aquarius? They say this is essential for your growth. Okay, okay. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, are there any more messages for those under the zodiac sign of Aquarius? Aquarius, you got the Three of Pentacles. Let's see what else that gives. Uh oh. Okay. Got the Ace of Cups. Mm hmm. Okay. All right. All right, and the Emperor. Well, well, well. Look like you'd have met your match, huh, Aquarius? So that Three of Pentacles is telling us that you're doing some collaboration. All right, uh, maybe you got some kind of little job going on. I ain't going to say no little job. I shouldn't have said that. I should say some kind of job because just because that's a little card don't mean that the job is small. It could be a big-ass job. You could be taking over a whole firm or something like that. But it says that you are collaborating with others and creating synergies to achieve a big results. Mm -hmm. Look at that. They say you balance at the wisdom of the experts and the ideas of the novice. All right? You balance the wisdom of the experts and the new ideas of novices. That's pretty cool. I like that. You also have an ace of cups here. So in spite of all this, so you, you listening to people that's telling you about this emperor's, okay, you feel like you was mistreated, right? All right? You found out that uh, uh, emperor's about to have a baby, Okay? Uh, you got some people that's collaborate, people that ain't had children telling you stuff and people that ain't never had a baby telling you stuff, okay? So you're taking it all in and, and you're gonna you're gonna process it and come out with your own uh your own uh idea concept. All right. All right, so let's see what your ace of cups means in this deck, all right? So your ace in this deck means that you are filled with happiness, joy and bliss. All right, they say you creative opportunities and you are abundant. They say there may be some new love, friendships, or even art projects available to you now. Cool. That's cool. And your last card, but not least, Aquarius, would be the Emperor. Okay? Now, this Emperor's card says that you are establishing structures and foundations from which your success, your success will grow. They also said that you favor stability and certainty over flexibility and change. You have the discipline to see your plans through. Well, Aquarius, you are the mother of the air signs or the father. Okay? So, we just can follow through. Follow your lead. All right, Aquarius, don't forget to hit that like, share, subscribe, and comment button. Get in where you fit in. If you don't find that in this video, please check your other placements, and I'll see you there, too. Check that uh, notification bell. Make sure that it is highlighted so you know the next time we go live or put out new contents. See you later. Yay, yay.